Hello and welcome to another SCOM tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to build an unraidable base. So as you can see from the video, we built this base in A1 sector in the fish factory village. It's unraidable with C4s or screwdrivers. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how I did it and what you need to do and what you need to be careful about. This base is built really easily and the materials are easy gatherable from all around this spot. So let's begin. First thing you have to do is build a front airlock that will make your enter and exit safer when you're doing it with a vehicle. So what you have to do is you open the doors, place the car inside of the airlock. So if someone is ganking you on the entrance and kills you, you can easily respawn in your bed and kill him before he gets deeper inside of the base or try to take the loot from you or even the car. So after you place the vehicle inside of the airlock, you're safe inside and you can relax and sort your loot. So after we did the airlock, we built a garage. The size of the garage depends on the number of vehicles you have and how many players are with you in your squad. If you're a solo player, then you should build a garage in which you can place one or two cars or a car and a motorcycle. After you build the garage around the base spot, you will start building the watchtower part. You will have to leave enough space for the watchtower and, an, and enough space for you to exit and enter the garage in a normal way. Be careful to place the tower so you can easily climb inside of your cabin. The watchtower needs to have the middle part as well and you place a table or two benches on it, place a medium target on the table and now you can climb on the base spot and you can start building your unraidable base. So here is where the real fun begins. Here is where you will build your base with all of your valuable loot. First you will place a small doors that point toward your watchtower and make sure you build it on the edge. You close it with the walls around it and be careful to place it on the edge of the space so you get more surface inside. When you start upgrading the walls, be sure to upgrade the base wall first so nobody can shoot you through the wooden walls. Try to upgrade it to metal first and to place wardrobe inside because they block the bullets as well. So after you upgrade the base walls, garage walls should be upgraded second Watchtower 3rd and you should upgrade the airlock last. Upgrade your doors as well so you can place more golden locks and once lock protections on them. Inside of the base, make sure to place a flag first, then table and put your bed underneath it. You can place some lockers on the table so you get more loot space inside of the base. After that, build two platforms that will make you defend the base a more easy job. You can pick from them and see where the enemy is coming from. So if you die, don't worry, you can spawn inside of your cabin and get your loot back. For the start, six wardrobes will give you enough space to save all of your precious loot. And if you need more space, you can always build where the watchtower is or even around the garage. Best part about this base and why it makes it unraidable is that you can destroy the medium target that lets you climb inside as you log out and that makes it impossible for the enemy to get to your base or even lockpick your small doors. They can't blow with them with C4s and even if they could they, would, they wouldn't be able to climb because he can't get to it without a medium target to climb on. So this is how you build an unraidable base in SCAM. If you enjoyed the video Click the like button or even subscribe for more future content. Thanks for watching and see you in another video.